Hi guys, uh, hope you're doing fine. Yeah, we are here again for another tutorial. And this time round, I'm going to show you how or what you can play when the church is, is praying as a keyboardist, what are you supposed to play? Because most of the times you find like a keyboardist is too noisy when the church is playing or during meditation. Uh, you know, you need to create uh, something or an atmospheric background that will at least create that mood of worship instead of playing uh, a lot of runs, a lot of things. So I think there is something here you can play and we are in the key of F sharp. We are in the key of F sharp. So I'll do it in F sharp, uh, then I'll do it in other keys like the key of F major, C and whatever. Okay, so what are you supposed to play when uh, the church is meditating or uh, the church is praying? You know, there is a time of meditation in worship and there is also a time of, of prayer. Okay, so uh, this tutorial is very easy. Even a beginner, I think even a beginner can learn from this. Uh, it is very short and you are just playing, I think you are only playing three chords. So uh, this is what we are going to play actually. So we are in the key of F sharp. So I'll start with left hand. On your left hand, uh, you are playing one and five. So for you to play in the key of F sharp, first you need to know the F sharp scale. That is uh, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, B, C sharp, D sharp, F, and F sharp. So this is number one. This is number two, uh, F sharp number one, G sharp number two, A sharp number three, B number four, C sharp number five, uh, D sharp number six, F number seven, uh, number eight is, uh, is F sharp or one. Okay, so on left hand, we are going to play one and five. Only, you will be sustaining in one and five. In all the chords, you'll be rotating around in right hand. Uh, left hand, you are only playing one and five one and five so this is one and this is five f sharp and c sharp okay so uh the first chord is going to be an f sharp f sharp major so you need at least to create that atmospheric background when people are praying or when people are, are meditating they are in the mood of worship. You are not supposed to be noisy, play a lot of runs and calls and whatever. You are just supposed to be, uh, to create an, a, a conducive environment for people to, to meditate. So uh, the first chord is going to be, that is F sharp major. F sharp major. So I'm playing one and five. I've said in the left hand, we are just playing one and five. Then on the right hand, we are playing uh, F sharp, A sharp, and C sharp. That is one, three, five. Just that. Then uh, you go to C sharp inversion on the right hand. Left hand you are sustaining on one and five. So you start with one, F sharp, C sharp. This is C sharp inversion. Then you play B inversion as four. B inversion as four. You're still sustaining one and five on the left hand. So let's play one, then five, right hand, then four. So you can, you can make it better than that. Those are just the basic chords, but you can make it better uh, than that. So you can do something of this sort. Observe my left hand, I'm sustaining. So you can do something of 
that sort. Uh, this is F sus4, F sus4. I'm playing uh, F sharp, B, and uh, C sharp. So one, four, and five. That is sus, a sus chord. I've created a sus chord. So you can start with that one. And then you make that thing, the grace note. Two, three. So you can do that way. So you can create that atmospheric background when people are praying. I'm in the key of F sharp, uh, F major, sorry. So make sure you practice this thing until you can play it at, le at least in three keys. Because it is a very simple progression. It's very simple, very simple. So I think you can see that I'm creating an, atmos an atmosphere when the church is praying or during meditation. And make sure you accompany it with uh, a pad. Accompany it with a pad. As you are, you are right to voice. So make sure you can play it in at least three keys. I'm in the key of F. I'm now in the key of C. It's very simple, very simple. Yeah, so uh, that is the thing that you can play. Uh, make sure you accompany your progression with a pad. I use a pad because I'm using a pad on the right hand. My keyboard is at least uh, supportive. It's supporting itself because it is a 750. So uh, you can use any pad or strings can do better also because I'm using a duck fat saw. I'm using duck fat saw. Yeah. Okay, so that is the thing. In case you have any question, kindly let me know on the comments below and I will help you out. So thank you and God bless you. Make sure you subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel. Uh, like and share this video. God bless you.